Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. Are you already having a panic attack? I, like, I feel bad. Because, honestly, same. I get those moments, too, where I just get mentally drained out. Now, who would bother to write that crap? Hating ass bitches? That, too, obviously. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? No, you're just a teenager that tends to overthink things. Like, then they're done that. Still do. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. See? Listen to yourself. Fuck it. Oh, come on, Max. Really? When a, a door butterfly? closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Now that is a nice, nice opportunity to get a good photo. This is Lover of Ladies, about to take a sick-ass picture. And I appreciate you tuning in to this week's Life Whoa, is strange. Where did strange. that butterfly come from? It doesn't look like any kind I've ever seen before. The blue wings are practically glowing. I, I can almost feel the air moving around me. The butterfly feels almost like a spirit. Like spirit within spirit? Why is a boy in the girl's bathroom? It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You you're okay, bro. Just... Come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. What? You're the boss. What kind of pep talk is this? So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am. He would be the one to pull out a piece, man. What are you man. doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! <gasps> oh, he shot her! Hey, yo, what's happening? Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. Deja vu all over again. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit. Can you give me an example of a <gasps> Se jodió la cámara. The human condition in black and white. Okay. Oh my god, crazy, bro. I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Victoria? Why Arvis? Because of her image. Damn, I'm actually reversing. Just enough to save my camera? I did it. Can you give me I actually did it. Photographer who perfectly captured I'm a human, the human time machine. Anybody? Holy Max, shit. Don't freak out. Not yet. You go, what is going on? Nothing has moved at all. Keep it together. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Uh, 
Okay, so obviously I'm not going to read everything, but images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally Damn it. haunted. When I took my selfie, selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. She, she saw humanity as if he does again, her. I'll notice and frankly, it's still bullshit. the same stupid picture. Keep so everything seems the same as before. Though, I could frame any one of you in a dark My corner. pencil case is still in the same place. Moment of desperation. Wowzer, my old broken camera is new again. Yeah, I would be freaking out too. Like, I could rewind any type of moment so I can escape awkwardness, tension, hostility. She could have taken another approach. I have to admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer Robert Frank. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming this. Know, it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For but for how long, though? What if that girl isn't dead yet? I the point can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. First. I need to go to the bathroom Once quickly and check it out. Now, Max. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. Are you serious? But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is oh, there anybody fuck you. you. Jefferson wants to keep me I after class, and I need time to save that girl. Types. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again process, and give him the right answer? Uh-huh, that's right. And if I give him the right answer, I'll be able to use the bathroom. Alright, this should be good. Uh, right here now max since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portraits uh right here the daguerrean process invented by a french painter named louise daguerre around 1830 Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. Thank you. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. But you can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an Everyday Hero. I'm going to talk to Kate again, see what happens. Um, same people ball. What are you waiting for? Go. Kate probably wouldn't laugh at me, but how can I ask her about what's going on? Nice answer, Max. Are you okay? You look pale. Kate, um, did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I'm just tripping. Too much stress. I know the feeling. This is just a bump on a bigger road. I, don't want I wish we didn't. I do have to go, but we can talk later if you want. I'll see how I feel. Thanks, Max. Okay, cool. So, I only want to share what at least I was able to comfort Kate a I see lot more you, better. Scofield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Come on, bro. Just give him the fucking picture, bro. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. 
John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Of course you would be a John Lennon fan. Whatever, bro. Victoria hasn't moved from that spot. Um... I wish I could go talk to Mr. Jefferson about what's going on. But I can't. What the hell? Okay, let me see what he says. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers, good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Nice. So I can actually make better choices, better answers. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. Yeah, and it's I not even to take a shed either. They'll think I'm crazy. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm crazy. All right, moment of truth. Bathroom time. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly, butterfly flew in. Yep. And I took a photo. And then at that moment... Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where did you get that? What are you doing? The alarm, the Come alarm, on, the alarm, the alarm. I need a hammer to break it open. Shit. Are trying to control me. Um, uh, move. Hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that Take. gun away from me, psycho! Fuck. Holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can yeah. lose time again, I can help her. All right. Control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Uh, Nobody this is so anxiety filled. Shit. I need a hammer to break it open. Uh, Shit. Okay. I'm going to go back way back in time. There you go. Don't ever tell me what Move. to do. I'm so sick of people Where is the to fucking me. hammer? You're going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Finally. No Don't ever touch me again, freak. Damn, this was very intense. Like, I was so anxious and everything. Another shitty day. All right, Max, get out. Happen. This cannot be real. Go, go, go. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not I don't know, Max. Freak out. Believe. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Fuck off. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Yeah, asshole. Fuck off. Up in my dick for what? Like, dude, you're just a security guard. Come the fuck down. Damn. Principal Wells always looks so distracted. I can never figure out what he's thinking. I mean, he is Does a principal of a whole school full of kids and teachers and faculty, so of course he's going to be stressed you out. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm, I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. Can I? Or you have sure? you done something wrong? Really, you is too? That it? Well, Max, talk to me. Let me breathe. 
I just got sick in class. Uh, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that teen toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. Bro, I don't think just your because... parents will approve when they find out. What? Now get outside with class. Just because I didn't want to yes. tell you? Fuck off. Yo, he's a pump no, his he ass. he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. Man, I am going to rewind. Um, how about this? Let me see what happens if I actually do tell him what I saw in the bathroom. I mean, what other option do I have? Clearly, he didn't buy off that excuse, so. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm, I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott? You sure? Yes. Positive. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. Oh, wow. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion Later, in my office, please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this academic drone won't do anything, since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? Nah, fuck it, I don't care. A quiet school in a fall place and even though it was a foul drill all these students are just chilling acting like it's recess or something Nathan Prescott please come to the front office thank you oh shit Rachel Amber she looks so hopeful and pretty I wonder what happened to her I mean the thing is if a person's been missing for more than 48 hours most likely they're dead. Miss Grant sure is dedicated to that petition. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Dorm rooms? Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Wow. Well, let me see. I guess cameras could have helped Rachel. I can see both sides. You're fair minded, Max. And we all pray Rachel is found safe and sound. Bless I us hate all. that. But this Thoughts petition and prayers. Isn't about her. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. 
The Native Americans? The tribes who were here first, who welcomed the settlers. No, Both they didn't. The mutual symbiosis and That's a lie. The pilgrims now, killed or with this drove lecture, the Native Americans please away. Sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984. Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Of course, go Megolo, because I signed the petition. Oh, what's this? Oh, whoa, 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 this is so much texting. I can't even keep up. Anyways, let me see what's going on. Do you want to meet for coffee after school? I need an excuse to not study. Please. Make sure you check out Neck Romantic on my flash drive. Mwahaha. Hey, Max. Let's bust shut up. Wait, I have to study for a physics test. So if we bust anything, we also have to measure it velocity. Don't ignore this message. Hi, Max. Can you get my flash drive? I need some info and space. Hello? Sorry, running late. Insane day. I'll meet you in the lot. Looking cool. You'll see. My camera will be ready. See you shortly. I hope so. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Okay, so where is this... Wait, press to open the journal. Objective. I need to go to my room to get Warren's flash drive. This is cool. Okay, so let's go get the flash drive. I hope I'm walking to the right place. Let me see. Dormitories? Yep, right here. Nice. I gotta check out to see how good these dormitories are. Are they better than the ones that I used to have? I need in to go there and grab one flash drive. Alright, let's go. Come on, Logan, bring it, bro. This is the dorm? Yeah. Yo, I can't help but listen to the sounds of them playing football. That Sounds so cliche. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. The Prescott dormitory? Good lord, Nathan's family owns my dorm? Awkward. Huh. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. So talk to her. Oh. Hi, Max. Now. Hi, Max. What are you reading? Love today or die forever. Don't even say anything. It's a bestseller. What to say? Good point. Now, if you'll excuse me. No. Damn, that's it. Okay. Awkward as fuck. Whatever. Are you serious? They're in the way? Oh, shit. There's Victoria and her mean girls. Oh, look. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Selfie hoe? What kind of diss is that? What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. Are you jealous about that? The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. But I did, I guess you got so. your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh Wait. my god. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. I'm yeah. about to Why grab you your phone. I'm oh, about yeah, to grab Victoria. your fucking I'll phone. Get your bony ass out of my way. Shove it up your fucking ass. Like, d can I rewind or? That's the first and last time I expect to hear that. Nah, I can't even rewind anything. None shall pass. Capiche? Fuck you. You're a hoe for that. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. There goes Samuel da Vinci to paint the window. Wait, wait, hold on a second, hold on. What if somehow... He is struggling to get up on that ladder. High key.
Huh. I have an idea. What if... Hmm. Wait, what's this? Sprinkler? I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Yes, let's do that. Like... I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Let me see here. Where is it? I'm about to make that bitch hella wet. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. So I can't use anything? This main sprinkler Come valve on. looks easy enough to use. I can't even use it. Uh, whatever. Damn, I missed something. I better rewind. I don't understand, like, what does this game want me to do? No. Think, Max. Rewind and find something. I forgot that this game is very much relying on context clues. All right. Ooh, you okay? Wait, hold on. Tamper? Oh, <gasps> that's what I missed. Oh my goodness. This is going to be so okay, funny. Okay, let's see if this works. I'm just standing here awkwardly. Ooh, I know you see me standing there. Do I look good, my dear? Do I look good today? Oh, oh. I'm just a normal type of girl who could unwind anytime and fuck shit up today. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right under the bucket. What the hell? So, what do I do? Thanks so much for almost ruining my outfit. You're huh. so lucky that I didn't. Anyways, while she goes and talks shit, shit that I don't care about, what if I. Okay, all right, so obviously I'm gonna tamper with this, right? But should I just like fight? Okay, let's see if this works. I'm gonna None fight. Pass. Capiche? Shit your bitch ass up. I don't know what to do, hold on. The ladder. There's nothing else to do here. Hold on. Nice, bro. No. <gasps> what the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look yeah. great. I can't even chill on the steps. But guess what? You're not gonna chill there at all because you're about to get soaked in paint. This is gonna be so fun. Watch. No way! Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh Samuel, is sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. That's right, hold on, bitch. Hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. I mean, after a couple of tries, yeah, but I'm glad it worked, finally. Wow. Sucks for you, Victoria. Oh, man. She looks so sad and lonely sitting there alone. I don't give a fuck. Fuck her. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Suck it, bitch. Don't. Don't say a word, Max. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. Yeah, do it. And no filter needed before I post this. How you feel now? 
How you feel now, Please Victoria? Me. I've had a messed up day and I'm going to my room. You do yeah. that? I know where you live. So does Nathan. Okay, good. And both of y'all can I just... shouldn't have done that. Whatever. I have to get to my room. Then... Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies. And I'll see you guys next week.